Sale, the patron of Randwick Rugby Club. Thank you for coming down for a chat. We're going to chat about the pre-season. And how's it been going with the club trials? It's been fantastic. The, uh, the, the pre-season's been well attended by the players. And uh, we've had over 80, which included the Colts and, uh, and Great and new players. And uh, we've been at Heffron Park. It hasn't put us off at all. It's been quite good training over there. It's a large block of land and we're able to all train together. And it's only well, Latham Park's gone over a refurbishment of, of grass, and um, it's looking magnificent at the moment. It gives us the ground to be able to train on. Thanks to Randwick City Council, they've done a great job. Council, our relationship with the council has always been good because we do represent them. We are Randwick Municipal Council is Randwick Rugby Club. Randwick Club. Rugby Club. And uh, how the the club trials have gone really well. Lots of good, great club spirits and. Uh, Team spirit on the field. Um, trials are trials, uh, and as we we'll say, with eight new coaches uh, and uh, new players coming to the club, um, nobody's been preconceived uh, as, as having a position. And under John Maxwell's supervision, the um, the opportunity for young people, uh, they, they show it on the field, they'll be selected. And, Fantastic. Uh, that's that's the only way to do it, so that uh, the boys understand uh, that they've got to put in every time they pull the green jumper on. And they'll be doing that on April the 14th at Coogee Oval. We have our season, the season kicks off. Randwick take on Manly Marlins. And uh, that, what, do you have a message for supporters? To well, we out? can't wait. For, <laughs> I actually thought it was the second game, but it's next week we're, we're playing against Manly, our old foes, Manly. We've played them in several um, grand finals. And, um, and uh, it's a, a wonderful thing to be able to get the community involved in our first home game. Uh, at Coogee Oval, it, it is our fortress, and uh, we have the cannons lined up, up facing up Coogee Bay Road for when they come down, because they know they're going to get a tough game, and we're not going to surrender our home ground advantage um, to anybody, and that's uh, something for the players to, to be proud of. But the selectors and uh, and the coaches and the players understand that our most important people are our, our are our supporters and our fans that come and watch. And the kids are uh, uh, bringing their kids down to watch the game and, and being able to come to the Club Limited after the game and have a, have a drink and, and enjoy the festivities of the, the five great games that have been on at Coogee Oval. And um, th that's been the history of this club for a long time and, and uh, we look forward to it every year. A, a new season is a start of a new era and uh, making people proud of the Galloping Bruins. Well, that's, uh, it's great to have you down here, Geoffrey, and uh, thank you very much. We look forward to the start of the season, and we'll be seeing you on the sidelines. Up the woods.